hand, which can be not only clever, but also accurate. This Android system is now being developed in the laboratory of the higher school of ETs. In the future, the robot will operate in space. Therefore, it must have excellent characteristics even in complete blindness. The hand can be feel an object, moreover, it can capture it without damaging. That is, it has a correction mode of action of the operator and automatically capture the operator without structural damage. This is where the dream of even every motorist can be implemented. To be independent from petrol and gas, scientists are preparing storage of kinetic energy. Function is the same as a battery has. However, developers from KFU are not going to jeopardize the fuel industry. Their idea should become a huge saving for data centers located in an environment where it's difficult to get an access to communications. Our laboratories uh, may be, uh, may be use, uh, may used, uh, using uh, in uh, modern UAF uh, from medium to large scale uh, for the data centers uh, of high tiers data, data centers with uh, high uh, uh, energy load and uh, any other uh, off-grid off -grid scenarios, for example, for modern telecommunication systems in uh, the growing countries uh, uh, as India or uh, several provinces of uh, Pakistan, China at all. If we are talking about data centers, especially those that are located remotely, the power supplies for them can be difficult. And you may experience difficulties with uninterrupted power supply. For data centers is very important to provide highly stable power supply. Besides, switching to conventional uninterrupted power supplies takes some time which is necessary to reduce to a minimum. Just an interruptible power system on the basis of the kinetic energy storage allows fast switching in case of problems with main power supply. But developers from ETs found saving solution not only for the storage of the information. Their development of the navigation area should help save the lives of people in emergency situations. This system can be used to search for survivors. Navigation system based on inertial sensors allows to operate in conditions of limited visibility, such as smoke. Thus, the robot is looking for the victim in a smoky environment when it finds using such system. It's possible to determine the location of the victim. Their invention they first of all offered to implement into a structure of the Ministry of Emergencies. In the meantime, it tested for Android hand, providing a smooth movement of the hand and improves the accuracy of actions performed in the space.